Okay, here's another one that I wanted to share. Uh, this is a combining and overlapping of other projects. And this is uh, one of the batteries that we made on the Bedini Earthlight project. And it was originally designed by Laser Saber. And it's magnesium ribbon wrapped around carbon or graphite. And uh, uh, there's a felt that's moistened with uh, distilled water and alum and then kept moist some way or just with humidity and it produces voltage and amperage uh, wattage at about uh, almost two volts and uh, it's uh, I used uh, activated charcoal it's a, a water filter element and that's what I've got going on here is that worked quite well because the surface area on the activated charcoal was good which gave me the amperage I needed it's not just voltage but you need the amperage to get the wattage and it's running my dynamo. And uh, while the dynamo is running, of course, it's it's powering something. So anyway, this is a combination of uh, two two projects. Uh, this was the uh, initial laser saber, and then John Badini and and myself and some other people developed this uh, rather robust battery. That uh, when it dries out, uh, the uh, chemical reaction between the magnesium and the carbon stops. If you don't let it dry out and you keep it on going, uh, this uh, magnesium goes away, it corrodes away. And you can see the discoloration right there in the magnesium. This will actually, if you keep it wet, just dissolve away. The alum and water will slow it down, but of course when you slow this down, you slow down your uh, power production too. It is a chemical reaction. But what I like about this is you can stop it by drying it out. And then get it wet again and it starts right back up again. And this is, uh, this is running the dynamo. It's uh, running along quite nicely, and uh, the standing voltage on this when it's unloaded, take a look at this, I'll unhook this for a second, it's almost 2 volts, load it back down again, that's where it is right there, uh, this thing is not very efficient, <laughs> I've decided, it's a fun project, but not very efficient, and I like the fact that you could um, pull off power while it was running, so... Anyway, I just thought I'd share that with folks, that you can combine your projects and, uh, and uh, have a lot of fun with them. Thanks for watching.